Hey everybody, it's me, the man at the bottom of the sea. Uh, we're playing Zero Escape, and I mean, there's might there might be some sort of there might be some sort of way to escape. I don't know. The, the statistically speaking, when you say Zero Escape, it means that there's probably not. But I don't know. I, I maybe maybe we'll get lucky. Anyway, June Page is considering stuff about why he's insane and why stuff's going on. Uh, we're gonna try and not die, and we're on the Titanic. Let's do it. And the others. Why are these eight people here? I don't know. And the most confusing of them all. Why am I a gamer? It's weird to think that all first class people paid a fortune to get a shitty looking room. Even first class didn't have the best services back then. Good thing that piece of shit sank. Those fucking mega corporations. <laughs> the fucking Titanic company. God damn it. Nickel and diving us. <laughs> that piece of shit sank. <laughs> Why did it. <laughs> It was God's curse for the avarice. Anyway, <laughs> most Why controversial take. Here? Who is this? Akane? Her since oh, I thought I clicked. I clicked on her face and she like twitched. And I was like, it's funny. This would be hotels in 2013. Why her? <laughs> Why now? Coincidence? No, I think not. There's no way. There has to be a reason. She's the zero exactly, escape. But there has to be. She's the murder guy. Very I well. think so. Very well. Standing around here won't do us any good. Best we get moving, don't you think? I like it. I like his this guy. I like Lion. I'd 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 kiss get him moving. on the mouth. Are you planning to open the numbered doors? <laughs> the numbered doors? Hey, wait! But don't tell me you're actually gonna do what this this zero says. God, could you imagine fucking waking up and this is the outfit you had? You'd be like sick. <laughs> You'd be like fuck. Yeah, great. Titties are out and my hips are fucking flying. No, no, that's not what I mean. I'm saying let's find another way. After all, we haven't really examined this place yet. Fair enough. What? Where have we not looked? Everyone searched a deck already, right? <laughs> Where have we not looked? There's literally nowhere else to look, dude. This that, That's it. And then they all just drown. Yeah, we were kind of in a rush, though, so we probably missed some things. Why nice. Why don't we check out the lower floors first? We should see how deep this place goes. I like Lion as well. I would kiss him as well, but with lots of tongue action. <laughs> I just sloppy on that Tompy, you know what I mean? I can work with that. Then let's go. Cool. All right, anyway. <laughs> Come, deck. Whoa. Uh -oh. Whoa, water! What the hell? It's completely submerged. Oh, no, Damn. that's not good. The water level keeps rising like this. We're all going to drown. No, I don't believe that's something we have to worry about. See? The water's not flowing. <laughs> that means the origin of the water has been stopped. Could you imagine that if you had to go pee in this situation, and if you, like, piss, you're technically helping drown yourself? Like, because you're helping the water level raise? I'm assuming there's not going to be some sort of uh, turlet that's easily accessible. Perhaps this Zero fellow has used some sort of remote control to seal a watertight door lower down. He said that our time limit was nine hours. In other words, this water won't rise for nine hours. Then you're saying we won't sink till then. Well, that may be a little too optimistic. No point to wishful thinking. <sighs> That's depressing. If we don't determine a way to advance from this point, we are stuck on A deck and C deck. Oh, okay. Looks that way. A deck, we are stuck on A deck and C deck? Wait, I'm sorry, what? A deck and C deck? Wait, what? Are they on C? I thought they were on C deck. Wait, what? Are they on B? All right, I'm hey, just gonna say, assume the game's right. C deck before we jump to any conclusions. C deck. Find something there. Okay. Huh, you're right. The one under. I'm sorry. The one under water. Wait. I, I'm I sorry. Look at the metal doors by the big staircase too. They're pretty suspicious. Was I on? No, I was on C deck when I got out of my room. They're pretty sus. The metal doors by the big staircase no too. No numbers on either door, and oh, I don't no. see an authentication device either. Nope. It's locked. This one too. Damn, none of the doors are opening. That's hey guys, too bad. Over here. There's another door behind the stairs. Huh. <sighs> this one doesn't open either. We'll see about that. Hey, old man. <laughs> give me a hand. Doom. Using force, I see. Let's give it a try. <laughs> Fuck, where's your voice from, you piece of shit? <laughs> Whoops. Oh my god. Oh my oh my god. It won't budge. 
Could you not just start shouting out of nowhere? You almost gave me a heart attack, you know. Oh my god. Oh. At least the peasants down there Sorry. have water. The pretentious rich pricks even have plumbing. You don't even have plumbing. Didn't even get to fart. That was the thing. You go for a nice little stroll on the deck of the ship. You'd be like, excuse me one moment. And then she like walk over to the side. Just fucking drop trout. Dump a little fucking turd down to the Atlantic. I thought someone got shot. Oh my fucking god. I know it seems like that, honestly. I see. Using force. And the guy's like, ah! It doesn't appear to have moved even with two of us trying. It's very well made. Or you guys are fucking little. Try oh. using your brain first. Shut up, dancer bitch. Huh? Take a closer look. A keyhole. A right. pee hole. It's obvious what we need to. I open need to pee. Store. <clears throat> a key, huh? You got a problem? No, I just really doubt we'll find a key that. <laughs> Wait a minute. There's a key right here. What's this? There's a mark on it. D does it mean something? Kind of looks like a titty hey, look, with a big nippy in the too. middle. Hmm? Hmm? More doors. Oh. I think they're elevators. Oh, There's cool. an inverted triangle button by them. Thanks, Mew. Well try pressing it. Huh. Kirk click. <laughs> the ship sinks one more when the water rises a foot. You're like, hmm, okay. Oh. <laughs> you're just like, <laughs> you're like, <laughs> Maybe the power isn't on. Oh, okay. We need to do something with this card reader. Yeah. And there's a strange mark here too. What the fuck? It's a. Oh, wow. What is that? It's like a guy, and his arms are out t posing, and he's got a big dong going down to the floor. What is this? It looks like a lowercase h with a dash drawn across the upper stem of the h. Okay. This is the symbol of Saturn. Oh, thanks, nerd. It's an astrological symbol. Okay, it's a brown one. The mark on the other door. I think that was the sun symbol. Oh, really? Oh. We saw the same symbols on A deck. Oh, yeah? You did? I don't remember that. A deck, huh? huh? I haven't been there, so I wouldn't know. We may as well check again since we're talking about it. All right. Well, up we go. There. Not great. Oh, wait, there it is. Next oh. to the stairs. It's the clock. The one on the left had a keyhole with a similar symbol engraved on it. She's oh, right. hey. hey. It looks similar to what we saw downstairs. Wait a minute. That's the mark of uh, Neptune. This is an Earth symbol. Fuck! The horizontal line symbolizes the equator, <laughs> and the vertical one represents the prime meridian. Prime meridian, huh? I see. Amazon Prime. Amazon Prime shipping. Use it now for the code below. Fuck, I don't know. <laughs> I should come up with a bunch of fake advertisements and just see if Amazon's like, hey, man, we'll, we'll hit you up for that. I'm sure Jeff Bezos would be cool. Hmm. The ceiling. Metal plates. Huh. It's as if it's covering something up. Are they just copying Dan Ropa? Fucking literally, you're stuck inside of a of, of a fucking structure, and all the fucking places are boarded up. Stupid. This game's dumb. Perhaps it was a dome of some kind. Dome. I wish we could get out through there. Probably could. Just hit Be it. Be realistic. We'd need a lot of explosives to open that up. The windows too. Huh. They're all covered. Wait. Oh my God. Just like Dan Ropa. We're trapped. All the exits go nowhere. Damn. Well, I'm sure they go somewhere. You just can't open them. Shut the fuck up. I'm gonna fucking kill you. You don't know that. For all we know, they just open into walls or take us in circles. All right, fair enough. No, I'm sure they go somewhere. Who thought Otherwise, it was a good idea to make everything be made be? out of wood? The Titanic and Sinka would have traveled back in time, start set, setting everything on fire out of pure spite. This shitty ship. What the? What did the Titanic do to you, Eli? What the fuck? What is this lore of you and this, you and the Titanic? It's fucking hilarious. This fucking piece of shit garbage ship. What happened? And we can open them. Well, two of them at least. Oh yeah. Four and five. Nice. Oh, you mean the number doors. Oh. Wait a minute. I think I said this earlier, but I don't think we should do that. Why? We'd have to be crazy to open these doors. I don't remember you saying we this. Do that. We're doing exactly what Zero wants us to do. Why is Shakira being so fucking <laughs> Eli's actually the iceberg? <laughs> Eli's dream job would be to be frozen in time. <laughs> be frozen in the Antarctic shelf 300 years ago and then beat the iceberg that broke off that would obliterate <laughs> the Titanic. May as well give it a shot. Antarctic? Can't stay here Arctic? I'm sure water flows. May as well give it a shot. Can't stay yes. here forever. 
I'm in favor as well. We can only exactly. We can only stay here for nine hours. No, I'm totally against this. Shakira. But shouldn't we at least try? We don't know what will happen. We should stay here. I think. I think. Honestly, I'm kind of with Shakira. I think we should all just die and drown. We don't have time for that. In eight and a half hours, this ship is going to sink. Eight and a half. Ah, oh, fuck. We're drowning. Maybe I'll try. I'm hey, gonna try. Shut up. I'm gonna try and get the ending where I kill everybody. Before we try and decide where we're going to go, there's something else we ought to do. We got What's to that? do. We need to exchange information. Did you know that there's people that think the Titanic wasn't real? What is like, what, I don't understand why that would be like, what, what government conspiracy is, like what's that tied to? You'd be like, oh yeah, it's too bad the Titanic sunk like 108 years ago. And everyone's like, okay, yeah. Uh, First of all, it was 110 years ago. And first of all, uh, it never did sink, idiot. What would, what would you gain from that? That Titanic is a government plot. It was all meant for James Cameron to make a bunch of money off of sympathetic, uh, off, of, uh, off of Titanic sympathizers. We don't know anything about each other. I want to know who you guys are. Who you are, where you came from, why you ended up here. Don't tell me you aren't curious too. Sink my fucking head. Bones aren't even real. You're telling me that if I just put some fucking curved surface on water, it's gonna float? Yeah. Okay. If I, if I don't float when I drink water, how the fuck is a boat supposed to do it? It's ugly. Look at the floor. They could have added gold highlights down there so everyone would be distracted looking at it and wouldn't have to suffer the sheer hideousness of the interior of this vessel. I mean, is this? I wonder if they actually went down there and and 3D modeled the Titanic properly. 1912 would it have electricity on it hold on one moment please all right you found it titanic's electrical plant was capable of producing more power than an average city power station of the time holy shit that's hilarious anyway uh, that didn't mean anything all right don't tell me you aren't curious too i agree i think jumpy is right shut up jumpy oh, i'm sorry i'm talking about him i just call him jumpy his name is Junpei. I don't like this We're bitch. We're childhood friends. We went to the same elementary school. Where we both drowned in a tragic Titanic-related accident. <laughs> Wait, stop. Don't tell us stuff we didn't ask you about. Zero's probably watching us right now. What are you going to do if he's listening in? Oh, would that be bad? I mean, fucking, he probably already knows. Doxed. <laughs> <laughs> he lives in one, two, three, to one, two, three, Shinomachi Street in Tokyo. She gives us, she gave, I know she did get, oh, pedal poison's on it. Oh my God. All right. All right. <laughs> I know it's going to fucking say, I don't know. Like I'm, I'm assuming zero probably knows it all. Zero's like, oh shit. I didn't know. I, oh, you guys know each other. Oh fuck. <laughs> oh yeah, boy. We don't know how much that bastard knows about us. Maybe he just picked a bunch of random people to kidnap. If that is the case. Then it'd be dangerous for us to let him know too much. It'd be dang and dangerous. If Zero knows who we are. He could go after our families. That's too bad. Maybe he'd tell us he had them to get us to do stuff, you know? Get us, get us to do stuff, you know? Like, like hold hands and like, and like hold each other and stuff and like, and like cuddle and stuff. You know what I mean? They'd be fucked up. They'd be crazy. I mean, unless, I don't know. But we still need to know what our names are. It's going to be hard to talk to each other if we don't have names. Why don't we just make up some fucking cool code names? I can be fucking like Dragon. This dude over here can be like fucking like Cyber Psycho. She can be Dumb Bitch. Dancer Lady can be uh, fucking Shakira. All right, then why don't we have code names? <laughs> My fucking guy. Code names? Yeah, code names, the famous board game. Yeah, well, Made by uh, Czech. <clears throat> anyway. Like, I'll be seven. Oh, that's smarter. Seven? Why are you seven? <laughs> I'm seven years old. Because <laughs> this bracelet number says seven. Does it? Or does it say L? Because you're a loser. Yeah, uh, <laughs> yeah that's a good idea. <laughs> I might have to hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I, can I do something that's going to make shiny? Hold on. I'm going to pop this guy up for a second. Hey, Shiny, you just got to cut something out, maybe. Just check check a little bit earlier. You'll remember what I'm talking. You probably won't, actually. I don't know. Might be spoiler-related. Just going to let you know. Anyway, good luck. Go back to... I hope, I hope you're doing okay. Bye. See? A tiny yacht... Uh, oh, a tiny yacht has better power management than that thing. And guess what? They decided to put all the machinery at the very bottom of the ship, what is the most vulnerable in case the water breaches the hull. Fucking morons, man. It doesn't help, I know. But they could have died with the lights on, at least. Less scary that way. Would you have been... <laughs> 
<laughs> this fucking Titanic slander. Wouldn't the what if it was at the top of the ship though? Would it wouldn't it be too top heavy? Wouldn't it just fucking tip over? <laughs> Doesn't it need to be at the bottom? That would make the most sense to me to make it bottom heavy. So it's like fucking and then the water displacement. <laughs> I don't know why I'm defending it. I don't know. I just. I just... <laughs> Why did not have lifeboats? Oh, I get it. Yeah, that's a good idea. All right, I'm gonna be Santa. Shut the fuck up. Are you chumps know Japanese? No. Well, San means three, so I'll be Santa. You know, like Santa Claus. Fits, don't you think? <laughs> fucking weeb over here. He's probably from fucking like <laughs> from this fucker's probably from like New Mexico or something. He's like, hey, you know Japanese? Yeah. Well, son means three. Baby, you gonna go build a boat? <laughs> Code name kids next door. <gasps> oh my. Oh wow. And they're actually all gonna be fucking. Oh, wait. Oh, this is literally kid name. Code name kids next door. They're all gonna be a number. Um. Then your bracelet number <laughs> must be five. Yeah, it's got a three on it. Good job, Grandpa. Silver, you're a bitch. Very well then. I'll go next, shall I? My bracelet number is one. So I'll be <laughs> Juan. Given that, I think Ace seems appropriate. Oh my God. I'll be Lotus then. As I'm sure you all know, it has eight petals. I didn't fucking know that. That would have been, that's a stretch, Which honestly. Means, of course, that my bracelet number is. Why don't you do eight because your boobs look like an eight? <laughs> I, don't, I don't fucking know. Classic! Another fucking hilarious joke! Eight. Nice. Eight is also the, looks like a B, and B snake. is the letter that goes into the word boobies. <laughs> I would appreciate if you call me snake. Oh, because it's like two or something, and it looks like a snake. My bracelet number is two. Since Ace has chosen cards, then I choose dice, snake eyes, clearly, which is particularly relevant given that I am blind. That's fucking hilarious. You're blind, bro? What the fuck? You can't see? I knew it. I use echolocation. <laughs> Boobies 8008IES. I'll help you. I have absolutely no experience in that, but I'm sure we do so much better than the complete airheads of designing <laughs> this nightmare of a luxury ship. <laughs> We were talking about that recently. There's some. There's apparently there's some guy. I don't know. Some apparently Meta. He's, he works for Meta or something. And his um he bought a, a a studio apartment on this cruise ship that like travels the globe or something like that. And it's it's very ritzy, very expensive. But it's got like all expenses paid, dentistry, doctor. They stop at, like all all these different locations for like five days, like Rome, fucking I don't know, Nice and stuff like that. Um, and he gets to live on there for like a year. And I was like, that's kind of crazy. It's like weird that you just live on a ship. And I'm like, that's so fucking like, that's so like futuristic. And then I was thinking about fucking airships. And I was like, I wish we still had those, man. I wish we still fucking could go on an airship. Fucking flying on a goddamn, of course, fucking Hindenburg had to fuck it all up. God damn it. Why did we have to put, why did we have to put fucking hydrogen? Is it nitrogen? No, it's fucking helium now. But we're running out of helium. Sad. Anyway. Me next. Four. Four leaf clover? You know, oh, because like three. Clovers have three leaves. Clover. Good luck, right? well, clovers have three leaves, right? Oh, I get it now. Number's five. Huh, so I'll be five. So my code name is going to be... Well, I have one. It's not like there's any point to it now. Mother... God, bitch. I mean, we all know your name already. You're Junpei. Oh, man. <laughs> then you should all call me by my name, too. Because, I mean, it doesn't seem... It doesn't seem fair to Jumpy. You're thinking it's not cool for you to hide your name after you told us his. Uh, What's your bracelet number? It's six. All right then. Uh, why don't we call you June? June. Oh, June and Junpei. June. Yeah, you know, it's the it's the sixth month of the year. Six months of the year in English. Any you any you guys uh, speak English? So you're June. Jumpy. Are you good with that? <laughs> You good with that? Can you remember that? Fucking idiot. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, then. So this is how everyone breaks down. One is Ace. Two is Snake. Ace, Snake. I'm going to call him. All right. We're going to. I'm not going to fucking. I'm going to. I'm going to remember. All right. It doesn't matter. Three is Santa. Three is Poopy Poo. Four is Clover. Fart face. Five is me. Dick balls. Six is June. Dumb bitch. Seven is seven. Big boss. And eight is Lotus. Shakira. That means eight of us have revealed our bracelet numbers. Bracelet numbers. 
The only Ooh. one left is... I like how they started off with the numbers and just went, nah, call me Matt. <laughs> well, there's no need for a code name now. That glasses oh. guy with hair like a bird's nest. Oh, does he not speak fucking English or Japanese or whatever fucking language they're speaking? <laughs> you haven't said a thing so far, have you? No, earlier he said... Ah! <laughs> what number are you? Mm. Hey, I'm talking to you. I'm talking to you, idiot. Isn't it obvious? There are nine people here, and you know who numbers one through eight are. I'm the only one left. So you're nine? Yeah. What's your code name? Uh, code name? Sorry, I was thinking about something. <laughs> what do you want us to call you? We all made up names. You should too. I don't need one. Why not? Because I am not going to stay here with you. Fair enough. You've got some sort of plan? I do. <laughs> I do. He just runs into the water and drowns himself. Yeah? What's that? You sure you want to know? <laughs> oh, I'm going to start killing you, fuckers! Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let me show you. Is he? Oh, oh he's definitely He's The murder begins. I'm going to do this. Oh, I don't, I don't like this guy. <laughs> I don't fucking like this guy at all. That, look at this. <laughs> look at this fucking, look at this fucking intimidating aura he's got going on. Hold on, let's give him the, uh, let's give him the old shiny doorknob treatment. Ooh, that's pretty good. Damn, I got, <laughs> perfect. Zero escape thumbnail. Ready, just like that. <laughs> ah, fucking Christ. I don't like this guy, though. I don't trust him one bit. I don't know if that's, I think that might be a little sus of me not to trust him. You know what I mean? Because he seems like a nice enough guy, but... Uh, anyway, sorry, I gotta, I gotta fix this stupid fucking mistake I made. Uh, uh, computer, play some, uh, copyright-free music while I'm, uh, uh, fixing this. Uh, computer, stop music. Computer, uh, uh th thank you. Thank you, computer. Alright, anyway, back, back to it. Uh, computer, computer, stop music. C com computer, computer, stop. Computer, computer? Com computer, computer. Computer? Compu computer? 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 Compu computer? Computer? Hey, we're back. All right. Uh, oh, yeah, I was recording all that. Whoops. I'm going to do this! <laughs> hey! What the oh my hell God. do you think you're doing? <laughs> I want <laughs> his fucking stupid face. Oh, Stay my God. Back. Oh, Fuck. damn. What? If you get any closer, I'll cut her open. Why do you sound like fucking, uh... What's his nuts? Why do you sound like fucking... If you get any closer! Uh, yeah, Gah. that's right. That's right. Gah, you what? Clover, are you alright? Alright, you can't see. Yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> what the hell are you trying to do? Oh. I told you, this is my plan. What Kill are you her. gonna do to her, you sick son of a bitch? Don't worry. Garnish. Not gonna do anything. <laughs> what does that mean? If she just does what I tell her to, I'll let her go. What's her name? Nine plus four. Nine plus four, 13. Oh, that's right. So you're gonna go through the door. No, it's three to five, though. You have to get three to five people through the door. Idiot. Uh, <laughs> slowly. That's right. Just follow me. Here. Verify. Uh. The left. Look on your left. Do you see the device on the wall? Place your hand on the scanner panel. The round part. The round part. What if I don't? Uh, oh, we got some more Titanic lore here. Sorry, sorry to interrupt the intense moment. Wait, as for your question, Shiny, would have sunk the ship in an entirely different manner if some of the machines were moved up on the upper decks. Since most of the weight was at the bottom, the center of gravity is located there as well. That's why the ship snapped like a toothpick. <laughs> All the weight was focused at the very bottom, and the tension was very high at the upper decks. A simple toothpick had better structure this engineering nightmare. Titanic tips. <laughs> Titanic tips with Eli. <laughs> Don't fucking build your ship like a moron. I want you to do a YouTube series of this. <laughs> Why the Titanic? <laughs> I want you just to do the conspiracy theory YouTuber. Why the Titanic didn't sink. <laughs> Why they found jet fuel at the site of the Titanic. Are you an idiot? What do you think? Are you a b, -b baka I could slit your throat right now. I'd just do I'll it then. I'll kill you if I have to. All I need is your bracelet. <laughs> just do it. Do it now. Uh, okay, I'll do it. Like this? 
Boom, 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 boom. So that's how it works. He called that round part of the device the scanner panel. If we put our left hand on it, our bracelet number gets entered into the device. Then... Should you total the numbers on your numbered bracelets and find that the digital root of that number is equal to the number of that door, the door will open. Door five. Is he trying to get into door five? Icebergs can't freeze steel hulls. <laughs> Iceberg can't slice metal. Last time I took an ice cube and smashed it into my fucking computer. <laughs> I don't care how strong you are, no matter how fast you throw an ice cube, it will always shatter on the hull of a 1912 ship. Why does this guy know Me so and my friends gathered all the sheet metal from around our dump yard and threw ice at it for four and a half days, and nothing happened. Wake up! But why does this thing know so much about, why does this guy, what is this guy, what is this guy? Hey, take a, take a load of this guy. Slitty Mc, the Slitty McGee. It's like he knows exactly what to do. Once he finished our ship. There, you know what? Junpei makes a good point. There is kind of something sus about this guy. I can't put my finger on it, but I don't know if we can trust him. Once we finished our ship, I'll throw a party at the exact coordinates where that glamorized shit bucket sank. Can <laughs> you imagine if we fucking... <laughs> the fucking... The poetic... Irony if we sank in the same spot. Good. Good. You're done. Next. You, right? You're the one with the number one bracelet, right? Aw, oh, Santa. Yes. Oh no. I Fuck. Am. Ace. <laughs> then so? you're next. Just verify your number like this little brat did. <laughs> what are you doing? Do it! Don't you care what happens to her? <laughs> okay, okay. Just calm down. He's like, not really. Okay, okay. What fucking god? I'm ready, the voice actor. I'm coming over. I just, I want to I want to I want to be able to sense it on my own. I want to be able to smell now, his voice. Verify. Verify. Right. This is what you wanted, right? <laughs> this is me, me getting Elon to make me Twitter official. No, <laughs> verify. We're gonna make millions, and then everyone at the party dies. <laughs> is it really? Now the device has both Clover and Ace's numbers, four and one. Is it really a party if no one dies? I think Petal Poison makes a good point. I think we should start murdering people as a group. Four plus one is five. <laughs> nice, okay. It's the same as the number written on the door, but it won't open yet. Only three to five people can pass through one numbered door. So what's Dummy trying to do here? Yeah, because I think he's an idiot because three to five, so he's going to add nine plus four. Fuck, one plus four is five, but he's got to put, put no, his number on the door. So plus nine, four. Idiot, if he went for door number four. One more person. If what Zero said is true, he needs one more person. Who would he need to get a five? Oh, he needs six. He'd need fucking, um, I don't know who six is. I can't remember. Who's six? Oh, he needs, uh... Dumb bitch. Who does he need? Get back. No! Farther! More than that! Go all the way back! Okay. It's pretty uh, good. I like the story so far. Don't tell me. Clover's four. Oh, uh, fuck. One. We're already doing the math. I'm sorry. Into the ninth man's nine. Four plus one plus nine is 14. Oh, he's, he's going to go through the doors. Stupid. Stupid, stupid, stupid and man. Two, two, 14. One plus four is five. Oh, did I? Wait, I, oh, wait, I'm an idiot. Words. <laughs> Bro, I'm so bad with numbers. Be the first to die here. <laughs> I fucking am clear. I, I just fucked that up. The game's like, yeah, digital roots. Make sure you know what they are, okay? Make sure you know how to do a digital root, okay? And I'm like, yeah, 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 yeah. Digital root, six, seven, eight, you know, whatever that is. And they're like, okay, all right, you got it. Here's digital roots one more time. I'm like, I'm like, yeah, yeah, shut up. Shut your mouth, stupid fucking Spike Tune Soft. How about you suck my, how about you tune on my soft balls? And Spike Tune's like, all right, all right, okay, all right, all right, all right, we'll back it up, we'll back it up. And then they're like, all right, so do the digital root stuff. And I'm like, huh? Where's the tutorial? <laughs> I giggle like that. Giggle like that with mirthful glee whenever I'm about to murder somebody. Thank God you were all so cooperative. Stab her in the throat. Now I can get out of this nightmare. Good. 
I don't need you anymore. <laughs> Wait! Here! She's all yours. That's speed that he didn't murder her, at least. <laughs> okay. Have a good one, guys. Oh, he's gonna die because you need three to five people to go through the door, I'm pretty sure. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm going verify it. Ahead now. Well then, goodbye. <laughs> Clover, are you alright? Oh, bro, just take a look. You can see that she's fine. Oh fuck, Snake. I'm so sorry. That's so that's that's fucked up. Alright, anyway, escape tips. All controlling during mini games is done by clicking the screen. Sometimes new hints will be unlocked if you fail enough times. Hey. <laughs> that's not gonna be relevant to me. Uh okay. Uh, this menu screen is so from the noises are so familiar uh back wait a minute wait a minute wait hold on hold on hold on hold on, hold on. oh my god all right are you clover you all right yeah i'm fine yeah i'm i'm, I'm poggers bro Darn. Bastard! Open, damn it! We can get through there still. I'm sure we can digital read something. Shit! It won't budge. Do you hear something? Like what? <sighs> like what? Like shoddy construction of the Titanic? Equipped with common sense and the internet, I'm pretty sure I'm capable of making a decent ship at least. It would make an entire meteor take an entire meteor to sink a modern ship. Even if it was to sink, we'd have enough lifeboats for everyone. And then we just continue the party there. Fair enough. May Honestly, I feel like, yeah, having common sense in the internet, maybe that would work. I don't know. I'm sure people said, like, there's no way the Suez Canal could get fucking bunged up by some big, big fucking specific container, right? And then <laughs> the Horn of Africa. Like some sort of beeping. Beeping, huh? You're right. I can hear it, too. I can't hear it. What is it? I don't, uh, what do you, uh, you guys hear something? Why is it stopping? God damn it! Goofy of you not to only go through there with one, one, uh, one person. You, you lied. Lied? This wasn't supposed to happen. This is wrong. This is wrong. What is happening in there? Open the door, please. I'm begging you. Help me. Please get me out of here. Get me out of here! Ah, God damn it! Why? Why won't it work? Oh. Engaged? Is it because it's occupied? Oh, whoops. <laughs> just, just flush the toilet! Flush the toilet! <laughs> Listen, I was lied to. He lied to me. He put me in here. Who did? It was him. He killed me. It was him. You gotta be more specific. <laughs> Explode. <laughs> Who lied to you? <gasps> Holy fuck. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> ah. A beep? A beep -oo. Did that thing just make that sound? Oh, let's open um, it up. The display changed from engaged to vacant. Let's see if we can open it. Okay. Well, it registered my bracelet number. I guess you'd only... Oh, you need three people. That's right. Finally, someone fucking died. We'll open with one person. We need at least two more people. What to do? Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. is math. All right, I'm just going to... Wait, can I just use the calculator? Hey! Five bladder plus... I could just do the math and figure it out. Hey, that works. <laughs> uh oh okay oh i have to choose uh, so all these numbers one plus eight okay so all of these would actually work ace and lotus snake and seven santa and june i hope it's as brutal as danganronpa <laughs> yeah but danganronpa was bad santa and june <sighs> Three plus nine. Okay, so yeah. Oh, so all these numbers equal nine. Dumb, dumb. Snake and seven, huh? Who do I get the best feeling? Who do I get the best vibe off of? Ace and Lotus. Yeah, sure. Ace, Lotus, you think you could give me a hand here? Hmm. Hmm. Uh, 
5 plus 1 plus 8 equals 14. The digital root of 14. This should do it. Now we just Thank need God. to pull the lever on the side. Really? Which you lever? You guys ready? Oh. I'm gonna open it. There's gonna be blood everywhere. Could be a bunch of goofy blood. Do you think oh if you were? God. Do you think if you exploded that fast, your body would void like just have enough time to void the vowel? Void. <laughs> Never mind. Good God. That's too bad. Whoa, that's pretty bad. He he blew up. <laughs> oh shit! Late reaction. <laughs> the door's like yeah. <laughs> June, uh, uh, are you okay? Try sound like her knees broke. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> where did this fever come from? <laughs> me, <laughs> me. When I'm explaining the plot of Zero Escape to Phoebe, and she passes out. <laughs> Any novel modes? Any visual novelers here? Uh, where did this fever come uh, from? <sighs> okay, okay uh, let's just rest for a minute, okay? Uh, you think you can walk? No. Here we go. How are you feeling? Are you all right? Why? Why did this happen? I don't know, Why bro. Why did this happen? Why does it look like you have this weird fucking bun in Do your hair? Do any hand? of you know what the fuck is going on here? All right, whoa, Who's okay, zero? I'm about to swear. What's this nonary game? <laughs> Come on, anybody? What the hell is going on? What are we doing here? What does nonary even mean? <sighs> Gaming. Ding dong, ding bong. It's oh, it's 8 o'clock. It's 10 o'clock, so we have... Yeah. That means it's been an hour since Zero's little announcement. Fuck! I had enough of this crap! Imagine dying first in a game like this and have the most boring death. Yikes. <laughs> no one's even going to remember you. You're going to be the guy that tried to stab somebody. He lied to you. So that guy was set up. Who lied to you, bro? How long are we going to pussyfoot around like this? Pussyfoot. That's what I'm talking about. We've only got eight hours until this time limit zero was going on about is up. Let's get going already. Go. Go. <laughs> I, I don't think we have time, bro. I don't even know the rules of go. No. I refuse. I'm not going to end up like him. Fair enough. Him? You mean the ninth man? Of course, who else? Blood. Blood? Blood and pieces of flesh. Mm. That's yep. no way for a person to die. I mean, it's definitely a way for a person to die. That guy just died like that. How could you say that? I'm and sus on Junpei, honestly. I think he just screwed up. A little fucking cherub over here being like... Rawr! He probably set off some sort of trap and that killed him. I'm not gonna screw up like that. I'm getting out of here alive. Damn. <laughs> I got it. Hold on. All right. I had to sneeze, but it's gone. That's so goddamn funny. <laughs> I was thinking of a meme I saw on Reddit earlier. Oh, my apologies. You were just uh, so very confident. I couldn't help myself. What the fuck? Do you think this is bull? <laughs> The way you said that was really funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> Fuck, he doesn't repeat it. I think you've mistaken the situation. Huh? The ninth man's death. It had nothing to do with the trap. Or at least not the sort of trap you imagine it did. Then? He broke one of Zero's rules. That was why he died. Quite simple if you think about it. Yeah, idiot. <sighs> you still don't... <sighs> All right. How about you take a moment and think back to what Zero said? Fucking Specifically, what did he say about the number of people? Said that there's like he people said in here. Only three to five people can pass through one numbered door, right? Oh my god! And after that, you've forgotten the relevant part. What did Zero say? Uh, uh. Zero said um, that everyone who verified no more than six people can go through. I'm, should I just fucking ruin this game for myself? Should I just fucking... That everyone who verified had to go. All those who enter must leave, and all who enter must contribute, right? I think it was something like that. Whatever it was, it, fucking. it means that groups of less than three or more than five can't go through. I like how he's like, I think it was something like that. It says it fucking furbate. Furbate him. <laughs> Furry bait him. Furry bait. 
Gold star for you, Junpei. Thanks. And he kisses me on the lips. Ever been on a cruise, Shiny? Did anyone, did anyone here experience one? I did. I did go on a cruise, and I was afraid of the ship. Uh, I remember I saw a movie or something like that where the, the fucking boat gets flipped upside down by, like, a tidal wave, and then everyone's, like, hanging onto the tables, and they're bolted in the ceiling, and they go, Aah! and they, like, splat on, like, the fucking ground. I just really didn't want that to happen to our cruise ship, but I've been on cruises before. I, I, I fought through my fear and overcame overcame the uh, – What's a cruise? Uh, it's an actor. It's a it's a mechanized robot. Uh, they were in Mission Impossible and stuff like that. The ninth man, however, broke that rule. Did he? He tried to pass through a numbered door by himself. I don't think he did. That was why he was executed. I I disagree. Zero's watching us from somewhere. Oh. Making sure we don't break any rules. Cool. Oh, I'm not so sure of that. Oh. Why not? Because this execution system is entirely automatic. You didn't notice? I don't think There's Tom no Cruise Landia. <laughs> My name is Tomas Cruise Landia, and no men exploding. What do you mean? Very well. I see it must be me who tells you. Sorry, I just want to say. What do you mean? <laughs> I've waited long enough, I suppose. I had hoped Zero might spare me mm -hmm. the trouble, but. If anything, you can eat and drink the entire that time. That seems exactly. increasingly unlikely. Yeah, zero. Do you know something? Well, bro, well, what? Well, I know a great many things, but Oh yes. my god, I fucking I'm going to you know? kill you. Here. A card? What does it say? <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> How would you know? Come on now, what's the point of giving me this? Is he from fucking Is this guy Is this guy in Skyrim? Is this fucking voice actor from Skyrim? Give me that. Huh? The hell is this? Oh, it's fucking Braille. I see. How ironic. <laughs> this is Braille. <coughs> Sorry, guys. I, I can't read this. Here, have it back. Okay, that was fun. What's so important about that car? <laughs> gotta lick it. You gotta lick it. I found it in my pocket. I can only assume it is a message from Zero. From Zero? A message? What? What does it say? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how to fucking read Braille. Calm I'm fresh now. blind. No need to panic. You don't need to force me. I'll read it. Okay, read it then, <clears throat> idiot. Bracelet number two. Yeah, I wonder if it actually says that. <laughs> wonder if the I, I bet they I bet they would have made it say that. Look at this little line there. This little run-on sentence right there. A little bit of something right there. Since you are not blessed with sight, I shall bless you and only you with information. I shall tell you of the function of the red, of the dead, and of the bracelet. Red Dead Redemption, baby. Let's fucking do it. <laughs> that was fucking stupid. I'm sorry. Wow, look at these guys. Cool, 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 cool. I, I can't wait to accidentally click on something on the um, Nonary Games Reddit and then spoil the entire fucking game for myself. The red. The red, the dead. The red, the red, and the dead. My name is Arthur Morgan. Sorry, I fucking missed all that. Uh, the red is the recognition device. It will verify your number. Beside every number door, you will find a red. Gotcha. Oh. I like how Snake was like, can't wait, can't wait for this fucker to just blow up. Where'd you put the bomb? Did you put the bomb inside my butt? Holy shit, Ace's voice actor voice like a lot of Skyrim NPCs. I fucking knew it! I knew it! I fucking knew he did! I was like, I was like, where the fuck are you from? Alright, it doesn't fucking matter. Anyway, I'm gonna cut this out, probably. If I didn't, pff, shit. That's on you, YouTube. That's on you. Anyway. I placed a small bomb inside of your rectum. And the people whom you are about to meet. What? Oh. So technically, he did put the bomb in your butthole. Because <laughs> it's going to go down there. I have no doubt. By the time you win this mint, the bomb will have passed your stomach and found it way to your small intestine. Oh my god, no fucking way. In other words, you will be unable to recruit it. 
as a guest in the next round. <laughs> it will explode from the butthole. As I mentioned before, the bracelet on your left hand contains a detonator. Think of it as a remote fuse, or timer, for the god in your body. There is only one condition to call it detonate. That condition is that you enter a numbered door. Once you have done so, the timer will activate, no matter who you may be. You will have 81 seconds. 81 seconds? After that time, the detonator has not been deactivated. It will send a signal to the bomb in your body, instructing it to explode. <laughs> At which point? <laughs> Every person who verified their number after red must also verify their numbers after dead. Once oh. all numbers have been verified by the dead, you need only pull the lever on its side, and the countdown will cease. Okay, cool. Anyone who does not verify their number after red will find themselves unable to verify their number after dead. That is to say, if you should pass through a number uh, time, first your number at the red, in 81 seconds, you will be dead. Oh, it kind of rhymes. Hey, wait a minute. That's kind of creative. Good for you, Zero. And then I woke up in a hospital room. I think I had something to eat that was bad. You must also keep in mind that the number of doors will close automatically after 9 seconds have passed. Yo, 9 seconds, 9 hours, 9 people? Is that the fucking name of this game? What does it say? 9 hours, 9 persons, 9 doors. Hey. As <laughs> long as the doors open, the day will not function. You would do well to remember this. What if enough people fucking died that, I guess... Anyway, what if enough people died that fucking and you couldn't open any, any of the doors? So long as the doors open, the dead will not function. You would do whatever to remember this. Lastly, let us ask how to remove the bracelets. <laughs> you must remove the bracelets. Taking a dump that I find sufficiently arousing. Escape from this ship to the heartbeat, which is zero. In other words, once the bracelet is taken outside the confines of the ship, or the backside of where its heartbeat has fallen to zero, it will shut down automatically. There is no other way to remove your bracelet. Okay, shit, let's all just fucking murder each other and the bracelet will come off. Hey. If you attempt to force it off, when you say go to the mayor, the bomb of you will immediately explode. This is all the information which I can impart to you. How you choose to use it is for you to decide. Cool. If used wisely, you can eliminate those who might be a danger to you. For a time, you would be able to control your fate. I wish you the best of luck. Thanks. Did we all do something so fucked saying, up in the past? So it's what it's saying is, and then he just reads the entire tutorial again. <laughs> only those who verify their numbers uh -huh, at the uh -huh. red can pass through the number doors. Honestly, I know that they're kind of being redundant with this information. I should, I'm going to listen intently because <laughs> I'm going to get fucked up if I don't. Teams can't add or subtract people after they're scanned in. Okay. The reds, deads, and bracelets enforce the rules. They're judge, jury, and executioner. Whoa. Can I help you, brother? Shit! A fucking bomb! Oh. C come out! <laughs> come out, damn it! Dude, you don't do regurgitate it, bro. Bomb inside me. If I could fucking eat God, the amount, the, the fucking, <laughs> the one time I'd like to just fucking mangle a fistful of prunes. What if you shot the bomb out? That'd be so embarrassing. Is it big enough to be shit out? What are you gonna do? You have to get surgery to get this bomb out? If you swallow it, it's got to be able to come out of your butthole, I would say. It's going to be a... <laughs> Talk about relieving dump. Oh, what made Zero think creating this horror show of a game was a good idea? All right. I'm going to ask one more time. Do any of you know anything about Zero? I don't know. Actually, I... I saw him. I saw Zero when I got grabbed. God, they sat hit Santa and fucking Junpei sound exactly the same. See his face though. Son of a bitch was wearing some kind of gas mask. 
What the hell? Me too. On, guys, give me something. You know, like surprise or something. I saw that too. I did as well. Me too. I didn't see inside the mask though. That mask, it was really scary. Huh? Oh, so all of our abductions were the same. We were taken from home at midnight. The person claiming to be Zero had a mask on. There was white smoke, and then each of us passed out. White smoke. We woke up to find ourselves on D deck in a room with a three level bunk bed. Oh, D deck. Oh, okay, I gotcha. They're fucking goddamn. They're puffing. Zero's, the, Zero's addicted to vapes. That's too bad, honestly. Takes another life. How about you, Seven? Did the same happen to you? No. Oh, me? Yeah, well. Mine was just like the rest of yours. Okay, uh, that's good enough for now. <laughs> I don't know if I trust that. I don't know if I trust so, that, bro. I have a question. Snake and Clover. What the fuck? You were both kidnapped from the same room, and you woke up together. What the? What the? Why is there fucking? Are these blush lines, or did you just get a fucking scrape on your face? So, what's the deal with the two of you anyway? We're siblings. What? Oh, really? Damn, that's weird. Siblings. Siblings. Uh, yes. Snake is my older brother, obviously. That means I'm his little sister. Little that fifth really so hard to understand. Yeah, it is. You guys don't look alike. She is correct, of course. I, <laughs> she's lying. Are you uh, surprised? Well, yeah, but why? There are other people here with connections to one another. What? Oh, yeah, that's right. Me and that fucking dumb Those bitch. Those two, for instance. He points at us. Oh, you mean between Jumpy and me? Shut up! Oh, yes. You did say you were childhood friends, didn't you? Wait, you went to school together? Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> so fucking, just, just fucking stand up straight. She's like, just fucking, uh, 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 fucking... You can have fucking lumbar lordosis. Lumbar lordosis. Anyone else who's got lumbar lordosis? Me, because I got a bomb and I'm about to shit it out. Ah!